Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver here, and tonight is already night 900. And eight of GameStop dumpster diving. And one thing I have to say, because I just have to say it, this bag smells disgusting, okay? You guys are lucky there's no such thing as smell -o vision at this moment in time, because this thing smells like somebody just like, I don't even know what happened. It smells like it's been in like in the dirt, in the dumpster grime. It's just, it even has like grease marks on it somewhere. I, I saw like grease marks on it somewhere. Yeah, over here's all grease marks. Oh, it's just, ugh, it's like dumpster sludginess, disgusting. Whatever you think would smell the worst thing, what would be the worst smell you, you would ever think? Wow, I can't phrase this, right? Whatever you would think would be the worst smell in the world, that's it. And the bag's not even open yet. So I'm thinking there's a moldy sandwich or something. I don't know. <laughs> also, new merch is coming soon. I'm currently in the process of getting designs made up and whatnot. So it's, it's coming, guys. It's definitely coming. And uh, it's going to be really cool merch. And also still doing a giveaway. So if you guys want to enter, just make sure you like, comment, subscribe, stay active on the channel. And this is New Year's Dumpster Diving, the day of New Year's. And there's two lucky bags right here. Well, hopefully they're lucky because it's a new year. First video of the year. And I'm excited. Ooh, 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 we already have a case. It's looking like 360. Oh, could be original Xbox though. I've been finding tons of original Xbox games. Now, one thing I do want to say as well, or the second thing secondly, is the way you can win the giveaway, like I said, just be, stay active on the channel by liking, commenting, subscribing. Make sure you comment. Also, try to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I'll be announcing the one lucky winner around J January 15th-ish. So stay tuned for that. You can win either an Xbox One, PS4, or a Nintendo Switch brand spanking new. Let's get into it. Gonna save the smelly bag for last. <laughs> Ooh. What the heck kind of sound was that? It sounded like a can or something. But uh, let's get it. Oh, it is 360. Okay, looking good so far. We got a 360 case for Tiger Woods PGA Tour 09. Oh, it is cracked on the top. I just noticed that. Oh, it's really cracked. The manual's in there, though. I can see the manual. That's pretty cool. Let's check it out. Oh, it's in there. Yes, the first case of the new year, everybody. It has a game in it. If that's not a good sign, I don't know what is. That is freaking awesome. Let's check out the condition. It's in okay condition. It's really fingerprinty and smudgy, but Tiger Woods PGA Tour 09. First game of 2020. So happy 2020 to everybody because this is a start of a great new year. Sweet. Let's get it. I think I see another case as well, and I think it's Forza. Oh, that's definitely Forza 2. Oh, wait, what? It's Marvel Ultimate Alliance and Forza 2. It's really heavy. And there's definitely something in there. That could be the manual, though. I'm not sure. Let's check it out. Okay, this is. A, I think it's like a double game. Oh, it is. It is a double game. For a second there, I was holding on to something with my finger. I'm like, is there another disc? There is. <gasps> that's freaking awesome. I think I've actually found this case before, but I don't think I've ever found the games in it. Wait, is it the... Oh, wait, are they two... Oh, wait, they're both the same game. <laughs> they're both... <laughs> okay, that's really weird. Uh, apparently right here, if you can see this, they're both Marvel Ultimate Alliance. There's disc one and also disc one. They're both the same. I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be like one of those dual packs. Let's see. No, because it just has one man. I'm so confused. I think it's supposed to be like a dual pack. Like it's supposed to have Forza 2 on one. Like one disc is supposed to be Forza 2. The other disc is supposed to be Ultimate Alliance. I'm pretty sure. Maybe I'm wrong. But okay, obviously these are both literally the same game. That is that's really, really weird. They are both the same exact game. Okay, <laughs> I guess someone tried to like trade this in the GameStop with the same game. I don't know. Maybe because it doesn't say disc one or disc two. That one's an okay condition. That one's an actually relatively really good. That's almost buttery smooth. But there is a little piece of hair or crack or something. I can't tell. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure this game literally just is one disc. I don't think it's two discs. So uh, that's definitely very interesting. Got to give it that. But still, we got two of the same game right there. We got some drink right there as well. No games in those sleeves. Oh, we got another case right there, and I think maybe potentially another one. Let's check out this one first. Oh, we got a DS case, nice. Let's check it out, it's Pokemon white version. We've been finding tons of Pokemon DS cases. Let's check it out. Wow, this case is hard to open. It does not want to open. 
Woo, look at that thing. Oh, sadly no game. <laughs> I was like, there's, it takes this much effort to open a DS game with one hand. I'm hoping there's at least a game inside. But the manual is in there, great case, sadly empty. We have another one here, which is Splinter Cell Double Agent. That's interesting. It even says, enter for your chance to instantly win a Chrysler 300C decoder inside. You could literally win a, like a real car? Could you have actually won that real car? Is that a thing? I never knew that video games actually did stuff like that. That's pretty cool. It sounds like it's in there, by the way. Oh, it is. That is awesome. I don't think I've ever found this game. Maybe I have, but I don't know. This does not look like a game. Well, this is definitely not a game I find every day. Like, I find Connect Adventures a lot. I find a lot of sports games. But Splinter Cell, and it's buttery smooth. It's like butter. Oh, man. Smooth like butter. That is... That is awesome. That is so, so cool. That's a sweet find right there. That is really cool. Let's see what else we have in here. Anything else? Come on. Got a lot of paper. Paper weight, sadly. Oh, I never did the weight test. Also got another one of these gift cards. Pretty cool. Probably going to find a lot of those styles because uh, Christmas recently just ended. Sadly, I know. I love Christmas just as much as you guys. But uh, it's... You know what, it's kind of like Christmas, it comes and it goes, but then you have the new year to look forward to as well, which is kind of nice. So uh, 2020, ooh, this year is going to be the year for dumpster diving. Let's check this out. What is this thing? We have, oh, I know what this is. You actually, you plug this into your phone and uh, this is actually supposed to have like a little, little uh, propeller little thingy and it's supposed to be like a fan. I heard these things kill your phones. Oh, it even has the Android dude on it. I heard these things actually kill your phones. I don't know if that's true, but I'm not going to plug that in. Also, there's no fan on it. I'm going to keep it for now, though. Maybe I'll find the fan, but uh, still, I, I don't know if I'm actually going to use it. What's that? That's oh, tape. Okay, I think that's it for bag number one. Now this is the part. Oh, there's even a case right there. Oh, I hope it's not like smothered it with food and grease and ugh. the way this bag smells just from the outside, like the aroma on the outside, it smells like greasy, disgusting dumpster juiciness. And I have to open it. I was thinking about not taking it when I found it, but then I was thinking, what if there's great stuff inside? Like I can't just leave a bag not knowing what's inside. So I took it and my car smells first of all, second of all, the room's now smelling. And third of all, I hope it was worth it. So let's get into it and find out. Like, you can even see the grease, like the grease marks. Ugh. If I could ever open this bag. Oh, there's the smell, but there's the case that I saw on the bottom. It's a wee case. Ooh, stinky. <laughs> smell of vision it could either be the greatest invention or the worst for this kind of reason. Oh, let's check it out. We got a case. We have, let me smell it up. Oh, the case doesn't smell too bad. It has a little bit of that really bad aroma, but not too bad. Okay, that's kind of cool. Uh, Showtime Championship Unboxing, and when I shook it, it sounds like the disc's in there. I've never found this game, by the way. And it's in there. Let's get it. And it's the right game. I had to make sure it's the right game, because I like this right here. Literally two of the same game in the same, and like, it's supposed to be two different games in there. It's two of the same. You got to make sure it's the same game. You never know. <laughs> so let's check it out. Oh, it's like mm, close to butter, close to it, but definitely a good looking game. Sweet, apparently it says 10 bucks, so it was a $10 value. So far we have one, two, three, four, technically five, because it's two of the same. So, oh, there's some dumpster juice, whatever it is. I'm waiting to just like grab a moldy sandwich. I know it's gonna happen. I see some more cases in here as well. Let's get some of these, oh, oh. <coughs> <laughs> it's starting to smell even worse. It's, it literally is disgusting. Uh, let's get it. We have Zumba Fitness join the party. Oh, it's not in there. No, the first case of the new year without a game. Well, actually, technically this one was. But uh, I wasn't expecting to find a DS game. But still, no, that is so sad. <laughs> but it looks like it's a uh, decent Wii case. Definitely going to keep it. It's pretty clean, actually. Let's check out, what do we have here? We have Madden 09 All Play. Oh no, another sadly empty game. Ah! <laughs> or empty case, I should say. But it's Madden 09 All Play, still a good case. Check it out, what else do we have? We got a stack full of these. We have this one, which is Ben 10 Protector of Earth for the Wii, it's kind of heavy. Oh, and it's in there, yes! I was thinking for a second, maybe these Wii games, like, they weren't gonna be in the rest of the cases that are in here. What does that say? 
That says a name on it. We'll figure that out in a minute. But uh, let's see right here. We have Ben 10, freaking epic, in okay condition. Not the worst, not the best. Don't know if I've ever found that game before. But still, oh wow, that's a really hard case to close. Still looking like a pretty cool game. So these three are sadly empty, but the rest right here, I want to keep them separate so I know which ones actually have games in them. But those ones have games, those ones don't, sadly. Uh, a couple gift cards, we're doing fairly well. This case as well says Johnson's on the back. So I guess this was Johnson's game at one time. Uh, Guitar Hero. Oh, and it's in there. Nemesis says Johnson's on the inside. That is so funny. Uh, let's check it out. Oh, that's in really good condition. Just some fingerprints. But uh, Johnson, I have your game. <laughs> I found your game with the garbage man or girl. It's probably a last name, so I don't know. But uh, either way, freaking awesome. That is so cool. Let's see what else. See, this is like this is a great like I guess not explanation, but a great like way to show you guys that like games that are traded in literally they, they go in the garbage. Like this is proof. Like somebody with the last name probably Johnson's, they probably traded this in, and it went right in the trash. Because I guess this is a game GameStop doesn't want to sell anymore. I don't even know if GameStop still sells Wii games to be honest. It's been a while since I've been in a GameStop, but uh, game I don't know. Do they take Wii games? Let me know in the comments below. I'm really not too sure. Because I've been finding a lot of retro games lately, so I don't think they actually sell retro games anymore. This has a sticky thing on it, so I'm not going to keep it. But, uh, there's a bottle. Where is the moldy sandwich? I'm waiting to touch it. <laughs> I don't want to touch it, but I know it's going to be in here. Is it really? What made that smell that is so disgusting? I actually was kind of curious. Like, I was very curious. I think you guys were too. I think a lot of you guys were waiting for me to touch something gross. <laughs> if you, you probably were, don't deny it. I, I don't see anything that could have been smelly in this bag. The inside of the bag smelled, as well as the outside. So whatever m maybe was in this bag it was smelling, and now it's not. I don't know. Maybe I accidentally threw, well not accidentally, but maybe I threw whatever smelly over there. I don't know. Okay, I think that's going to be it. The bag still stenches, but uh... I really don't know. I'm gonna recap what was found tonight. We got a couple gift cards. The little fan blade thingamajiggy that has no fan blade, but it is supposed to be that thingy. Uh, also, it's basically just a fan for your phone. Uh, two empty Wii cases, empty DS case, but we did get a stack of one, two, three, four, five, six games. So in my book, six games, that is a jackpot right there. And I think a lot of these games I haven't found before. We have Guitar Hero, Ultimate Alliance, which is two of the same discs in the case, which is kind of random. Uh, ben 10. We have a boxing, I almost said unboxing, boxing, Splinter Cell Double Agent. I think this is my favorite game that I found tonight. That is, that's just awesome. And also Tiger Woods PGA Tour 09. And what makes this game so awesome right here is this was the first case that I opened in the year 2020 and there was a game inside. That is great. That is just, that right there shows to me that this year is going to be one of the best for dumpster diving and i hope it comes true and i hope that's the way it's going to be thank you all so so much for watching if you want to stick with me on this journey of dumpster diving and trying to find really cool stuff and saving it from being thrown out and destroyed make sure you definitely like comment subscribe and also those are entries into the giveaway so you should do them also try to follow me on instagram and twitter for all the latest updates of the giveaway as well as when i announce the winners or the winner i should say just the one lucky winner and uh yeah so just make sure you guys try to do that stuff i will be all also over here, leaving the best recommended video for you, my recent gaming video over here. I just finished a game on my gaming channel called Close to the Sun. Go check it out. I'll put the ending video right there. Also, make sure you subscribe to the gaming channel if you enjoy that video, and subscribe to this channel for more epic videos like this and also more crazy awesome giveaways. Like I said, you can win either an Xbox One, PS4, or a Nintendo Switch. Brand new. See you guys tomorrow, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Wait, hold on. Don't forget about the new merch dropping soon. Stay tuned for that. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.